What's up, YouTube? Uh, and I've been getting really into Photoshop right now. So then I was gonna show you this uh, this picture I made. It's kind of an animation. This is what I made. Hold on. Okay, it's now starting. Okay, so it's not like it's an actual like game and it's making a sound, but I made that. Like I can show you these are the layers I used. This is all the animation. Took like an hour and a half. Made it though. Today I'm gonna show you how to do some of the animations. Like when the squirtle shoots the magmar. <coughs> Sorry. When the, sh when the Squirtle shoots the magma with a water gun. So you're going to probably want to start off grabbing your renders. Make these a little bigger. And then grab the magma. Drag it in here. Alright, so I'm not going to set everything up again because that would take super long. But here's basically how I did it. So I went over here to the tool, got a circle, and then you're going to want to make it blue. And so I started off near his mouth. Okay. Now I downloaded this tear brush, so I'm just going to push brush, then I'll make a new layer. And let's just make two. So now since it's its own layer, you can move it around and they both move. So that's what you want. So you want to go up here and just make sure you have everything laid down like the way you want it. And then we're going to start off by actually hiding both of these. And then click duplicate. So here, I'll show you again. So you want to click down here, and if it's not on, go to Window, and then press Animation, mine's on. So you want to click this, and click Duplicate Frame, and so you're going to have this. Then you're going to want to unhide, so show, <laughs> uh, this first circle. And then you're going to duplicate that layer again, and then you can move the circle around any way you want, make sure it's selected. You can move this around any way you want and just end it up right near where it was. And then you're gonna play you're gonna press this button down here that has little circles and just put you can just put ten frames because you're not gonna need to change it. So then it's gonna go like this. It's gonna show you each frame it gets a little closer to where it is. And then finally, it's that you want. So right here, this is what's going to look like. So at the last one, you're going to want to press duplicate layer, and then hide that ball, and put the little water drops, and move those down to where you place the ball. So then it's going to look like this, and then you see the little drops at the end. Now we're going to duplicate that one more time, and then we're going to move the drops down. And then we're going to press this little tweens animation frames again, put another 10, and this is what it's going to look like. Shoots it, and then the water drops down. And then if you want to do it again, just press the last one and then find the one where your droplet started. So it mine's 14 if you're following along. And then press shift and press 25. And then drag it down to duplicate frame. And it'll do it again for you. It'll just put the whole thing again. 
So here it is from the beginning again. No ball, ball shoots it, water drips down twice. And then I'll just keep going. But you can make it faster or slower by these seconds. You just press down here and you can make the last one five seconds. So it just stays there, it looks like it's ending. So star squirtle used water gun, drip, drip, done. And then you can hide it on the last one. So yeah. That's my guide for you guys. Not too hard. Really pretty simple actually. I just used it. Um Yeah. Check out thetechgame.com pretty sick site got some cool modding stuff on there all kinds of games minecraft xbox ps3 even Wii for you who have those everything so that's it hope you enjoyed comment rate subscribe like do what you need and i'll see you later